word of the day is quaternary. It's an adjective, and it's relating to or based on the number four. It can also refer to something that occurs in groups of four, such as a quaternary system or a quaternary structure in biology. Today's word is bicenary. It's an adjective, and it's pertaining to 200 years or 200 items. It refers to something that occurs or is measured in a 200-year period. New word alert, novenary. It's an adjective, and it's relating to or based on the number nine, or to systems involving nine elements. Picture this. You walk into a swanky auction house that's been in business for 200 years. It's classic. Old school vibes with velvet ropes and chandeliers dripping like they're straight out of a historical drama. The auctioneer steps up to the podium, clears his throat, and with a glint in his eye, announces, Ladies and gentlemen, we are selling a bicenary set of something wow. The crowd leans in, intrigued. What could it be? The auctioneer smiles and opens the box. Inside, it's 200 antique rubber ducks signed by the Duck Dynasty. But wait, not just any rubber ducks. Each one is arranged in a quaternary system in groups of four. Four little ducks float in perfect symmetry, each set representing a different historical duck era. You can practically hear the gasp from the crowd. Just when you think it can't get any wilder, the auctioneer raises his gavel. And for the grand finale, the ducks can be rearranged into novenary groups of nine for ultimate chaos. The room goes silent. People are frantically raising their paddles, bidding on the most absurd thing they've ever seen, an investment in rubber duck history with a side of math. Your wealth.